What's going on guys? This is AK Spartan Killer and welcome to another surgery simulator game. Now, this one is pacemaker surgery. My stomach's already feeling queasy. Dude, I don't know why I do these. These make me feel so sick to my stomach. But check it out. You guys ready? Guess what kind of shirt this is. Guess. Guess what the graphic is on it. Guess. 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 Are you ready? Da, 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 da. If you guessed Iron Man, you are correct. I picked this up the shirt the, the other day, actually. Man, man, my camera's not working. Okay, there we go. Uh, uh. Iron Man will get me through this. I picked up the shirt the other day and a couple other ones. I may let you see them. I might not. You never know. You'd be like, what shirt is Zach wearing? Oh my god, I don't know. Alright. Oh, look at the little thing. Oh, look at this old guy. Oh, God. Morning! Meet William. William has a heart problem. The conduction system, which controls the heart rhythmic beating through electrical impulses, is failing. We may need to place a pacemaker in his chest to regulate his heartbeat. First, we need to check the current condition of his heart. We must take a blood sample. Okay, see, first off, pro tip, Zach, aka me, aka AK, does not like any needles. No, no, no. I have not had blood taken in many, many years. Why? Scared of needles. Have not had a flu shot. Why? Scared of needles. I do not like needles entering my skin. My body's fine with all the fluids it has. So, William looks like a 90-year-old Asian man, and I don't know what that other chick on the uh, right side is, but is she, like, there to, like, be like, please help my dad. Please. Because she's, like, trying to guilt me into helping him. Be like, can you please take some money off? And then my crazy five head of an assistant is here we need to perform a blood test on william let's get him into blood testing room it should be one of these three oh i don't know was the blood come from his ribs or the the green speedometer maybe this one that has the syringe filled with kool-aid man i have something in my eye oh god i need a uh... hold please i need to gather myself Uh, sorry, William. Ugh! Tap it. <laughs> Hello, little bit. Uh, scalpel! Oh, no, wait, what? Oh, sanitizer ripes. Sanitizer. Psh, 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 psh. We got the butterfly needle. Why do I need a butterfly needle? Oh. Now I'm gonna look. Oh, God, I need to put it in. Ah. Okay, there we go. Take an empty vial. Oh, not looking. Something happening? Remember that? the butterfly needle? Thank you, Will. Oh! Didn't shoulda not a look. Oh! Apparently, I turned into some Jamaican. Oh man, I shoulda not a look. Plaster? Dude, that's a band aid. It's not plaster. Remove the tourniquet. Sorry, William. You're gonna lose your arm today. Very good. We can now. Oh look. Oh. A sample of William's blood has been placed under a microscope. Now we can examine his blood in detail. He seems to have a low number of red blood cells, or that word. This may be due from a failing heart. Aww. William. Come on, Will. Okay, doctor. We need to perform a, that word to see William's cardiac rhythm. Let's get him to the, that word. Room. It's behind one of these doors. Eeny, meeny, ma. Okay. Please select the electrodes from the table. The electrodes are usually composed of a small metal plate surrounded by an adhesive pad. When I had to go get an EKG done, this is pretty much what they had to do. They placed them all around me. This chick's like, can you take off your shirt? I was like, I most certainly can. Help me. And I put my hands up and she was like, ah, oh, and I was like, just kidding. So I took off my shirt and she had to put like all these little doodahs around me. It was crazy. It's like the electrode holder. Oh, that one. And then she clips them on. You boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. And then they hook it up to a machine and they have you sit down and they you just test it. Okay, doctor. We need to take William to the operating room. Oh, maybe this one. Ah. 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 If you are eating, keep eating because this is going to get good. Good work, doctor. Now we need to inject an intravenous anesthetic. Elise selects the syringe. Live, man! Just two-handed. <laughs> That's right. What? What? What is that about? That's right. 
Let's sterilize the chest now. Oh, baloney. Dang it. Dang it. Tongs. Cotton. God dang it. Freaking messed up on you, William. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Pick up the marker. We're gonna go ahead and draw a smiley face. Now we're gonna make an incision. Oh, God. I don't know if I wanna do this. Oh, God. I'm sorry, William. I need my... What's it called? The bovine. Bovine. Oh, please, like the Santa... No, no. Oh! What? Pick up the retract. Oh, God, it's gonna pull him open. Ew! Is that soup? Please pick up the scalpel again. Oh, I need to cut it further. Hello, William. Oh, okay. It's a football. That's all it is. We'll use the leaves to connect the heart to the pacemaker. Please pick them up. Stop putting it in! Holy monkeys! Oh, don't look! Here we can see the leads inside the Kefa vein. This vein is connected directly to the heart. Okay, great. Congratulations. That's awesome. Thank you for telling me that. We're ready to insert the pacemaker now. Please select it from the table. Bing! Bing! Broop, broop. Hey, there's my hand! That's the first time I've ever seen my hand. Hey, surprise! Snug it! Snug it right in there. It's a snuggie. Please turn on the pacemaker to start the electrical impulses. Good, now you can remove it. Oh, William, you're done? This was the easiest one ever. Oh, wow. Needle. Boom. Pick up the thread. Boom. Oh, it's making the... It does the skin. Please select the patch. You're welcome. That's it? Baller! You're welcome, William! I am the best doctor in the world! Play as the intern? What is this? What's that? Oh, I think the intern is the... The intern is someone who needs help. Wait, can I back? Can I go back? Can I be done? Please focus, doctor. I'm not a doctor. I'm a... Th I'm a... Th I'm a thingy. What's it called? Can I get rid of all of these? Oh, dang it, man. Can't... Man, I don't want to do this anymore. Leads. Pacemaker. Where's the one that I need to not... The butterfly needle? Oh. Pew! 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 Man, I don't, I don't want to do this anymore! I am not gonna operate on you again, William. You have already got your business taken care of. Stop, I don't uh, I don't wanna do this. Right click, uh, I don't wanna do this. No, no, uh, uh, F5. Maybe this will work. Can I just restart this? Oh, there we go. Well, that's nice. Try these similar games, no thank you. Wait, is that good? Hey, there we go. Oh, wait, it's not going to give me the other thingy now. Oh, I have to play as an intern. Ah, baloney, William. William, you son of a gun. Well, that's me. See, at least they got my uh, hair color right. And maybe my skin color. I'm pink. Duh. Didn't you know that? Um, okay. So. Oh, tonsil cereal. Ugh. Okay, so I have no idea why I play these because I am very squeamish. If you don't know what squeamish means, squeamish means that the sight of blood will make you feel a little funny looking at the inside of stuff. Uh, it's making me gag. Looking at the uh, inside of like body parts and such will also make me not feel the best. So I have no idea what the frick I'm doing playing all of these things. Like this is like confronting my fear, I guess. But um, we we only have a couple more games to go, and then we're done. Almost all of the surgery games in existence forever, so that's a good thing. Um, but uh, let's see. There's tonsil surgery coming up. Um, what was one of the other ones? Let's let's pick between two. There's tonsil surgery, and there was ear surgery. Do you guys want to do tonsil or ear? 
ear tonsil tonsil ear let me know in the comments yada 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 you know what the deal is but as of right now it looks like our time is up i hope you enjoyed this episode hopefully you didn't throw up leave a comment down below on whatever you are thinking and i will see you guys next time peace